that in both scenarios, and I'm sorry, I mean, if, if you're, you could take this how you want to take it. Um, I knew that if Danielle and you were on the block, or you and Joe were on the block, that you would stay in both scenarios. And let, me, let me ask you a question, and this is like the most pertinent question to me. Sure. What makes you think that I can ever feel like I can trust you after this? Because I gave you my word on my vote. I gave you my word. Everybody with, jumped ship when they knew it was six to four and there was no chance. That's I never jumped Mike, ship. I never Mike changed. Mike even jumped ship. It was nine to Mike one. Wasn't you guys part left Kale out Nick, to dry. Nick and myself had always stayed with Joe the whole time. You can ask Nick that. He'll back it up. I talked to Jen the night before. I told her, I told her, I go, the vote is going to be eight to two or nine to one. I go, because there's not enough votes. People and that the jumps. people that are, she goes, it will in no way possible will you have a nine to one vote. I go, I think Mike is wavering. And she goes, you're wrong. So Mike Mike was. and Jen, no, Mike and Jen jumped ship. Nick and I always stayed with taking Jen had Joe no out. vote. I'm sorry, then Kale, I'm, whatever. I don't know how it, I, I can't. Kale took the fall for all of you guys, and no, she no, no, was no, no. pissed, and that's why she rolled over on everybody. But you have to understand, Kale kept coming at me and Nick saying, hey, you need to vote Dick out. And we both said, sorry, we're both voting Joe out. If you want to, if one of us, I, I'm sorry, that, that's not true. Kale kept coming at Nick and myself trying to get you out. I told her, I'm voting Joe out. If you want to get to Nick and tell Nick to vote Dick out, then I'll also vote Dick out. That was how it was set up. I put all my beans on Nick because Nick said, dude, we got to get Joe out. I said, dude, I totally agree. The bigger of both evils in the seat at that time was Joe. I wanted him out more than anything well, in my because fucking Because he had spread life. bullshit about you. Not even. No, we, we, well, we were I mean, sitting outside. He I didn't spread even bullshit care. about everybody. I didn't even care about that. I mean, that's a contributing factor, but overall, he just loved to rip open people's wounds in front of other people. At least you had the dignity to come at, like, Kale, or, which I wasn't there for, or Jen, and be like, this is bullshit. Now, if you wanted to come at me and do that, that's fine. You and I can duke it out all you want. I wasn't 100%, but, but and no, no, no. I not, didn't go at Kale until I knew for a fact. And I wasn't going to go whispering in little groups like a big secret. No. I got her, and let's and do that's the Kale show, bitch. And that's how I am. But if I have somebody like Joe coming in here and just ripping open those fucking wounds while like you and I are having are duking it out, I don't appreciate that one bit. And Joe's a douchebag. I'm glad not, he's gone. That is that is the sole reason and why Joe, he needed to go. Listen, Joe, that motherfucker that I put my neck out, which I didn't have to at all, because what the fuck do I care if I'm up against you or if I'm up against Joe? What the fuck do I care? Sure. Honestly, dude, I would have stayed in either case. And honestly, I knew you weren't going up, and I kept saying, this is such a long shot, it's such a long shot. I can keep my hands clean. I laid the groundwork, and I let everybody else fucking do the whispering in the ear. Sure. And what did Joe do? When it didn't happen, or Joe went on the block, Joe went and fucking told everybody that it was all me, and he's trying to throw me under the bus, that motherfucker. But I didn't care. After I exposed my vote was my already judgment. made. But you understand what I'm saying about Joe. So anybody that was on the fence, including Tamika or, or anybody else that was wavering even a bit. Sure. That is what I told them. You want Joe? You want me. I'm the one who exposed myself for Joe, and look at what he did with it. What is he going to do to you? Sure. He had no chance. Well, no, I'm just telling you the reason that I was so adamant with Joe versus you is, <clears> one, <throat> I did make an agreement with you, yes. And one, I was going to stick to that regardless. It didn't matter. It wasn't even like a real agreement. It's just like, I got no, your back. I'm sorry, but still. If you want to know the benefit of the doubt, fine. You don't have to trust me. I don't care. I mean, I do care, but I don't. Um, secondly, Joe was the fucking person that would open up people's wounds in front of other people and get other people riled up, and I didn't appreciate He's that. He's gone, and I'm glad. So. And that's why I wanted him gone. Well, me and too. Now, and, now, and now there's a second one, and it's Jen. A little bit more first stable off, than that, don't you think? I can't on. believe that. Fucking first of all, that's not that's that's my personal opinion. 
That doesn't go outside this house. I haven't conversed that with anyone. I set up 